High in the Alps, just a few miles from the Brenner Pass, a picturesque villa is the meeting place of Allied authorities and German political and war prisoners. Among them are the wife and daughter of former Chancellor Schusnig of Austria. He was married during captivity and one of Hitler's former financial backers, industrialist Fritz Tyson, with his wife. Many royal prisoners were brought here from the Dachau prison camp, as was General Halder, formerly of the German general staff, and Pastor Niemöller, the anti-Nazi Hitler dared not kill. Also among the liberated was a group of allied flyers and the nephew of the King of England, Lord Lascelles, captured in Italy. Another of the freed was Lieutenant John Wynant, son of our ambassador to England. Farther north at Magdeburg, we meet a German of a different stripe, General Dietmars, Nazi military radio commentator and previous military governor of Magdeburg, surrenders to the Yanks. Dietmar's voice had failed long ago, and he used a double, like many another fallen Nazi blowhard. 